Yeah, Shalom, Shalom. We the Hebrew Israelites from the camp of GMS Cleveland. And before we get started, we will give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakhakwadash. We give honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who were well, and peace and blessings to the hopeful elect that preaches truth across the four corners of the earth. And um, this is Brother Bakar, and I'm doing. Uh, video with my fellow brother Ma'a Kwadar. Shalom. And um, like I said, we're from GMS Cleveland and we out here visiting Chicago and we just came up to do a little topic on these wicked ass two thirds, man. These two thirds is so rebellious, they so stiff necked, they so wicked. They, they, they is gonna never turn back to your how about and I was shy until the kingdom. Until right. they did that, um, that, that grievous death, you know, and the first scripture I had, this was, um, Isaiah 30 and one, it say, woe to the rebellious children, saith the Lord, that take counsel, but not with me. And that's the spirit, because uh, two thirds of our people, you know, they don't take no type of, you know, counsel when it comes to your hot boss, me, I was shot, you know? You know, here it is, Yahweh Shimei Al Shah. All right, he he set up his prophets, man, for you to uh, basically, in so many words, inquire of him, man. All right, and uh, we out here to give you people the counsel of the Lord, man. And you know, our people reject it. You know, and that's why the scriptures say, "For my people is destroyed for the lack of knowledge." Since thou has rejected knowledge, I will also, you know, basically, and roughly paraphrase and reject thee. You know. All right, go ahead, brother. They say, and take a cover, take a cup, and that cover with a cover, but not with my spirit. And let me bring this precept out real quick, Bubba Kasha, man, because hey, back in the ancient days, you know, our people knew that in order to inquire of the Lord, you had to go to the prophets, man. All right, and uh, this is uh, 2 Samuel, well, 1 Samuel, uh, Shalakia. All right, this is uh, 1 Samuel chapter. Nine, verse nine, it says before time in Israel, when a man went to inquire of Yahweh, thus he spake, come and let us go to the seer. For he that is now called a prophet was before time called a seer, man. Oh. So hey, in order to inquire of the Lord, man, you must go through the prophets, man. All right, because the Lord, what? He set up things, uh, you know, decency and in order. Decently and in order, man. All right, so once again, in order to inquire of Yahweh, you must go through the prophets, man. All right, can you bring that back from the top, Bubba Gashah? Con, this is Isaiah 30 and 1. It say, woe to the rebellious children, saith the Lord, that take counsel, but not of me, that and that cover with a covering, but not of my spirit. That they may add sin to sin. Because that's what Jake want to do. All right. They take coverings and, uh, and you know, and uh, Esau's false doctrines, man. All right. They take coverings in these uh, religions, which they're giving, uh, you know, praises to the uh, idol, false idols, man. All right. So they can do what, brother? Add sin to sin. sin. And, and, All right. And, and, because iniquity. commit iniquity. Because in the Christian church, man, you know, they, they tell you that what? Come as you are. That's their uh, 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 slogan. Come as you are. So, hey, they don't care if you, you know, you know, a man dealing with another man. All right. They don't care if you eating pork. They don't care if you come in there uh, with lineups. All right. They don't care if you uh, uh, commit adultery. All right. So you, you take a covering of these uh, uh, these different uh, uh, religions so you can continue on with your wickedness, man. All right. Because, hey, man, and it's truth, man. You know, those things are not going to be tolerated, man. You know, the Lord is not the author of confusion, man. So, you know, you you, you got to serve, serve the Lord and, you know, with a sincere heart, man. All right. Go ahead, brother. Uh, it say that walk to go down into Egypt and have not acts at my mouth to strengthen themselves in the strength of faith. Right. Because, hey, in this society, man, our people, you know, are, are, are strengthening themselves. You know, with the with the things uh, from Esau, man. Really, they ultimately, man, they're not they not strengthening themselves, man. All right, because they're they're making themselves uh, become weaker. Because in order to really and truly strengthen yourself, you have to come through your hot boy Shimei Shah, man. Because he's the he's the one that he's the supreme being, man. He's the ultimate power, man. All right, but you know, 
Hey, they strengthen themselves with what, man? You know, Esau's uh, stimulus checks. All right, like not, we're not saying that uh, it's off to get one. All right, but that's what our people, you know, look for. You know, they don't look for your Haba Shimi Shah at all in no situation, man. Anything that, hey, or, you know, hey, man, our people, you know, has a problem with, they go straight to Esau. You know, they don't even try to even go to the Lord for anything, man. So they stripped it in themselves with, hey, basically with Esau, man. All right, which, hey, a key read on that book, because y'all believe. And to trust in the shadow of Egypt. Right. Therefore shall the strength of Pharaoh be your shame. Right, so, hey, you know, hey, man, you know, all the Esau's, you know, uh, um, hey, man, Christianity is... Is, is, bring that back again, Bubba Gashah. It say, therefore, shall the strength of Pharaoh be your shame. Right, everybody run to a uh, uh, sweet Jesus, man, to strengthen themselves, man. It's going to be your shame at the end, man. Everybody runs to Esau to strengthen themselves. You know, when you go through something, man, you know, you go straight to Esau for help. So, hey, man, trusting in Esau is going to be your shame because at the end, man, none of these, you know, you know, these false deities, you know, you know, none of Esau's. Uh, uh, hey, the Esau system is not going to uh, sustain you in these days, man. Your food stamps, all right, your, your, your checks, your unemployment checks, man. All right, none of these things is going to sustain you in these last days, man. All right, because the scriptures say that wisdom and knowledge shall be that stability of that time. And that wisdom and knowledge must come from your high boss, Shemia Oshah, man. So that's why, you know, hey, Esau's uh, society, Esau's system it's going to be your shame at the end because there's nothing that's, that's going to profit out of it, man. All right? Con, it says, and trust in the shadow of Egypt, your confusion. Yeah, it's going to be your confusion, man. Because a lot of these, that's all it is here is confusion. Here it is, uh, America's the land of confusion, all right? But you trust, two-thirds of our people trust in everything in America. Everything in America, man. All right? So, yeah, man, the, the trust in America is going to be your confusion at the end, man. Which Yahweh Shimei Al-Shah, once again, is not the author of confusion. All right? Come on. All right, let's get the first nine. It say that this is a rebellious people, lying children, children that will not hear the law of the Lord. There it go. Hey, go ahead, brother. Get Come it. On. Right. And two-thirds. Hey, that's about the two-thirds. Two-thirds don't want to hear the law. They don't want to um, stop eating abominable foods, um, commit idolatry, commit adultery. They don't want to... Stop smoking. Doing, they don't want to stop doing wickedness. That's right, brother. Because they're rebellious. They, they're lying children. They want to they wanna hear what they want to hear. They want to do what they want to do. They don't want to hear the the um the law of the Lord, man. Because and, why the law of the Lord, you know, the law of the Lord is order. Huh. You know, and Jake don't want to order, you know. Jake don't want order, man. You know, real order, man. You know, Jake want to be wicked. Jake want to be accepted in the society. You know, Jake don't want to be looked at as an outcast, man. All right. Jake want to be looked at as, uh, you know, a man. Basically, Jake want to be Jake want to be in that fit in spirit. All right. The scriptures say, you know, don't follow a multitude to do evil. But here it is. Jake want to Jake want to fit in, man. You know, Jake don't want to be different from these other nations, man. All right. It's say um, verse 10. And let's go back to what you were saying earlier. It say, which say to the seers, see not, and to the prophets, prophesy not unto us right things, speak unto us smooth things. Right, so that lets you know that our people know that the things that we're calling them up for, hey, because the scriptures say, cry aloud and spare not. You know, lift up thy voice like a trumpet, show my people their transgressions, and the house of Jacob their sins, man. So our people know that those are right things that we're telling them, man. Hey, our people know that Jesus never helped them out, man. Our people know that these pastors in the churches are are, are, are are bullshit, man. Excuse my language, man. All right? And out for money, man. That's why the scriptures say, that, hey, man, speak unto us. Uh, don't speak unto us right things. Speak unto us smooth things. All right? And, and guess what? Esau is the most smoothest, deceitful person on the planet Earth, man. All right, and that's why our people lean upon Esau, man, because he's gonna speak those smooth words, man. And the scriptures say that his words are smoother than butter. All right, and that's what our people want to hear those smooth words, man. They don't want to hear about, hey, if you break this law, man, you're gonna be put to death, man, or the Lord is gonna send judgment upon you. They don't want to hear that, man. They want to hear that everything is gonna be okay. They want to hear lies, man. Everything is gonna be okay, man. Just keep your faith in Jesus. 
He will, he will trust in Jesus. All right? Oh, it's okay. The Lord loves, the Lord loves you no matter what. Everyone, hey, you know, come and get baptized. You know, hey, and, and, and you're and you're saved. All right? Hey man, you know, give the give the give the church your money, man, so you cannot uh so you can avoid going to hell, man. They want to hear those things, man. Which is not true. All right. Go ahead, brother. If it's something you want to get or Prophecy speak about. Deceits. That's right. All right. So they want to hear the lies. You know, we can hey, cause um cause the, the, the truth go hurt. The, the the truth go uh they hear the truth, they gonna have to change their ways. But no, they wanna just keep hearing them lies. Well the truth hurt so they can do their wickedness. The truth hurt. You know, you know, the truth hurt, man. And and that's why, you know, when when you call it a, you know, you could be speaking about a certain topic and a Jake can be walking past who's indulging in what you're talking about. And then he gets spiritually cut, man. All right. And then he becomes angry. Like, you know, we speaking about, you know, uh, all a nigga want to do is, you know, smoke weed all day and and uh he a dude that's just smoke weed he just happened to be walking past and he gets spiritually cut now he angry you know because hey the truth hurt man you know hey you know so so jake want to hear these lies man you know jake want to hear that the things that they're doing or the things that jake is taking pride in doing they want to hear that you know it's okay the lord understands man no the lord doesn't understand man if you break in the Lord, the Lord don't have any understanding, man. Now, the Lord understands that, you know, we we rehearsing the righteous acts and that we can't keep the law, you know, a, a fully 100% here. The Lord understands that. But you just being straight wicked, man, the Lord doesn't have any understanding in that, man. Uh, all right, this, um, this is um, Jeremiah chapter 4, verse 22. It says, for my people is foolish. They have not known me. They are, they are sottish children. Hey, what's the reason why the people have not known the Lord? All right, because they're not taking heed to the prophets, ultimately, man. All right, because, hey, man, in order to, like I said before, in order to, you know, seek Yahweh Shimei Awasha, in order to, you know, learn who Yahweh Shimei Awasha is, you have to go through his prophets. So the reason why the people are not knowing who the Lord is, because they're not, they're not uh, taking heed to the to the men of the Lord, man. Start with the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, first and foremost, man. All right, go ahead, brother. They say they have none understanding. And the Lord called his people stupid. Sodish, man. Jake is stupid. Here it is, man. You're the salt of the earth, man. Here it is, man. The Lord, you know, you know, created you to be, you know, the the the, the, the prince and the princesses of the world, man. All right, the Lord, the Lord loves us, man. The Lord set us above all these other nations on the planet Earth. And here it is, you know, <laughs> man, it's, it's sad, man. They say they are wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge. Hey, that's crazy, bro. Jake could tell you how to do some wicked shit, man. You know, you, know, you can ask Jake how to, you know, you know, man, rob a bank, man. You can ask Jake how to, you know, how to, uh, you know, roll a uh, stuff, you know, uh, grams of marijuana in the, in, the, in the shell, man. Jake could tell you all type of wickedness, man. Jake could tell you how to uh, uh, do a scheme. Uh, uh, you know, Jake could tell you how to, you know, sneak in somebody's window or, you know, break in somebody's house, man. But Jake can't tell you how to break one scripture down in the Bible, man. Jake don't know what it is to, you know, rehearse the righteous acts, man. You know, Jake Jake don't know what it is, man, to to, to keep the Sabbath day, man. Jake don't know anything about a high holy day, but Jake will tell you about, you know, how to, you know, Christmas Eve and, you know, Thanksgiving and Easter. You know, Jake will tell you about all these holidays that they celebrating, all the gifts that they bought someone for Christmas, you know, but Jake don't know how to, you know, prepare, you know, lamb for the Passover, man. Hey, the scriptures say, hey, say to bring that back again, huh? Jake uh -huh. said that they wise to, so hey, Jake is wise to do some wickedness, man. Jake is wise, man. When you ask Jake how to do something that's uh, unrighteous, Jake, Jake, Jake will give you the whole breakdown to it, man. But as soon as you, you know, you ask Jake about something that's righteous, you know, Jake acting like you speak in another language, man. You ain't have to. You ain't got to go back. Right, go ahead. If you got something else, brother, or want to speak on it. All right, huh? But 
they're, like I said, they are wild to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge. You know, they don't have, um, they, they don't, they don't have, um, the, 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 the righteous act stored in their head, man, because the scriptures say the fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge. And they don't fear the Lord, and that's why they don't have knowledge to do good. You know, so all they know is wickedness. That's right. But this um, this Proverbs 1 and 24, because I have called and ye refused, I have stretched out my hand and no man regarded, but ye have set at naught all my counsel and would none of my reproof. Hey, but just to make mention, the Lord said he have called. Hey, the Lord is not going to call you on FaceTime, man, or Google Duo, man. You know, the Lord is not going to come down personally and uh, and say, hey, hey, you right there. You an Israelite, man. You know, get it together, man. Because hey, if the Lord was to do that, man, hey, I'm sure that, you know, everyone, uh, you know, you know, you know, come back to the Lord. But that ain't how the Lord operate, man. All right. The Lord set up prophets. All right. To, to, to hey, like Noah, you know, you think the Lord came down to talk to those people? And told them that uh, he was about to bring a flood through. No, man. He set up Noah to do that, man. Uh, all right. So this is how the Lord is calling you through his prophets, man. When you see a video on YouTube, man. All right. Of Great Millstone or someone who's in a, you know, same sound doctrine. You know, hey, man, that's the Lord calling you, man. You know. It's but, a, I also will laugh at your calamity. I will mock when your fear coming. Go ahead, brother. Uh, yeah, so yeah. when when you went when you in trouble when it's just a trouble and your family getting their head blown off in front of you or if you getting tortured or you um starving in a famine, guess what? In that time the Lord gonna be laughing at you because like he said in Job, at destruction thou shalt laugh. Talk about who? The same man that was um trying to tell you to get right, then go he gonna use them same man to laugh at you. That's right. In that day of trouble. That's right. You know, because you didn't come back to the Lord. You didn't serve the Lord. And ultimately, you know, those, you know, false idols that, you know, our people is worshiping, man, you know, they not gonna perform, man. You know, Buddha not gonna perform, man, in, in, in these last days, man. Buddha's not gonna save you out of these plagues. I, I, hey man, hey man, Allah is not gonna deliver you from these plagues, man, that the Lord is bringing, man. Hey, Jesus is not going to deliver you from these plagues that the Lord is bringing. Hey, the scriptures say that the Lord killed and make alive. He wound and healed. Neither is there any that can deliver out of his hand, man. Which, hey, they can't deliver themselves, man. All right, your Buddha, your Buddha statue fall over. It can't even pick itself up, man. But you putting all your trust and faith in that, man. Hey, Jake is, hey, Jake is idiots, man. And Jake deserved to be destroyed, man. Hey, man, that, hey, man, Jake deserved to be destroyed. Two-thirds of our people destroyed Shalakia, two thirds of our people, they deserve, they they deserve this 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 death by a severe pain that the Lord is gonna bring upon them, man. All right, so hey, you got anything else, brother? No, that's it. All right, so with that, we go and close out, bro. We'll give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakhodash, to the honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who were well. And peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. Shalom and abide for ball.